Welcome back. Today we're going to look at the difference between genitive endings aya and uyu of the nouns. Quite a bit tricky topic. Also for Ukrainian people, not only for foreigners. So let's have a look which endings will have nouns in the genitive. Is it aya or is it uyu? There are specific rules. If we are talking about nouns describing objects, humans, Professions, towns, measurements of weight, length, time, and currencies. Then we would have ending aya in the genitive case. So, vykladač, vykladača, olivec, olivca, this one is a fleeting year, Lviv, Lvova, Paris, Parisa, metr, metra, kilogram, kilograma, vivtorok, vivtorka, dolar, dolara. But if you are talking about feelings and conditions, talking about abstract nouns, nature phenomena, games, countries, rivers, food, buildings, and parts of the buildings, the ending would be U and U in the genitive case. So conflict, conflict to ispit, ispitu, basketball, basketballu, hockey, hokeyu, dosht, doshtu, moroz, morozu, Kitai, Kitaiu, Yehipet, Yehiptu, we saw this in the previous, one of the, my previous videos about countries and cities. Din, Donu, Borscht, Borshtu, Med, Medu, Lid, Lodu, Vokzal, Vokzalu, Mist, Mostu, Supermarket, Supermarketu, Mahazin, Mahazinu. But there are some exceptions. So, for example, Vik, Viku, Rik, Roku, Listopad, Listopada. And rivers like Dnipro, Dnipra, Dnister, Dnistra. So, try to remember these exceptions for the genitive case. Hope this video was useful for you. Please comment and subscribe.